we'll discuss the recruiting process or a little bit of it. And the truth is, this is a long, stressful and tedious process that absolutely cannot be done by the player alone. So parents have to be involved to some extent and the extent is major. The parents will play the role of the behind the scenes technical personnel. Parents help plan and schedule calls, interviews, school visits, and also prepare the player on questions to ask the college coaches and questions that might be asked of the player. With the recent change in the recruiting process, coaches are unable to recruit players until the summer after their 10th grade year. This has slowed down the process and allowed for more players to mature and develop in their game. The 11th and 12th grade years. These last two years will go by faster than lightning. Some players will already be committed while others will still be in search of a home. This is absolutely fine and extremely common. Players will really be in full swing of the recruiting process calling coaches, coaches calling players, players sending film continuously, keeping them informed, players making sure college coaches are aware of their club schedules. Some players even go that extra step and send emails on how to find them at the tournaments. Junior and senior year is very stressful and time consuming. But parents, this is where we have to step in and help. We cannot think that our players have the capabilities to take on this process alone. Players, this is to you. I know that you think you are grown, that you have everything figured out, that you are old enough to handle things, but you will quickly find out that you simply cannot. Now look, what we are asking players to balance, drafting emails, intro emails, updating emails, declination emails, and responding to rejection emails if they are sent. We're asking to reach out to coaches, tracking which coaches were called, or ones that still need to be called, and what was discussed during those conversations. Making highlight films, which should be done after major tournaments, if there's enough content. Going to school, maintaining attendance, grades, which consists of homework, homework assignments, quizzes, and tests, extra school activities for clubs, such as drama, robotics, STEM, debate, and much more. Maintaining employment, because some players must work for any extras, and club volleyball is extra. This is just a snippet of what is on the plates of these juniors and seniors volleyball players. It's also good to know that while yes, there will be some that get committed early and that's great. Some get recruited later on during their senior year, but there will still be others that actually get recruited and committed during the summer after the senior year is over. And that's okay as well. Everyone's journey is different and unique to them. 